I have a famous quote by famous people series I'd like to begin and start. And so this famous quote to you today is brought to you by Coca-Cola. Nothing to say about Coke other than uh, I think AdWords is going to tag something to this once I put it on there. So this quote today, today is from Victor E. Frankl from his book Man's Search for Meaning. And I think this one is very, very powerful. And we, and we read... When we are no longer able to change a situation, we are challenged to change ourselves. And uh, I think that's really uh, true and prevalent in our day. You know, because we uh, there's a lot of us a week ago, we're still very saddened by um, the way the results were, the way things panned out on November 6th. And... Uh, you know, we can't change that. We can't. There's nothing we can do in our in our current um, day, week, and hour. There's nothing we can do at this moment to change those things. You know, th certain things just happen. We just we have to roll with them. We have to do what we can do. Um, and I and I want to say that um, what we can change is how we think. Um, I don't know the exact quote by by the same man, but I was I was listening to it the other day when uh, Victor Frankl had said that uh, nobody cause could cause him to think something that he didn't want to think, and this is when he was living in a concentration camp uh, many many years ago. So I want to leave that thought with you that no one can cause us to think what we don't want to think. If we choose to believe that we are free and that we are truly free to live and do the things that we choose to do in this life, regardless of what country we're from, if we choo truly choose and we truly believe that that we are free to do as we choose to do, and that is a God-given ability for us to be here. It's our, our agency to choose, and those are those are also important. If we honor that choice and we understand that choice, that it is our choice to, that we choose to live our lives as we choose to live them, and that we choose to acknowledge and, and remember our Heavenly Father and all the things that we do, that uh, we will not only be free in this life, but we will be free to choose in the life to come. And I say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.